The following BLTV program is brought to you by O'Flaherty Law. Please enjoy. Welcome to Learn About Law. My name is Kevin O'Flaherty from O'Flaherty Law. I hope you find this video and podcast helpful. If you need some help, please feel free to call us at 515-207-2006. We offer free consultations in many areas of law, and we have several geographic locations for your convenience. We serve all of Iowa. We're also happy to meet with you and provide most legal services virtually without requiring you to leave your home. Enjoy the video. Hello, I'm Gene Nassif, an attorney here at O'Flaherty Law. My practice areas include business transactional matters, as well as some landlord-tenant issues. Um, I also do a bit of family law. Now, today we're going to talk about the children's preferences in Iowa custody proceedings. Custody proceedings occur during divorce or separation from a partner. The issue of who will take care of any children you have together will be an important part of these matters. In Iowa, every custody case involving parental rights and responsibilities begins with the court deciding who will have legal custody of the children and who will have physical care of them. Legal custody means who has the legal rights to make decisions for the child. This can range from where the child will go to school, what religion they will practice, as well as any medical decisions to make for the child. Physical care, also known as physical custody, refers to where the child will live. If you want more information, see Iowa Code Chapter 598, Section 1. The court can and often does reward joint custody for parents, which means both parents must agree to various decisions in the child's life. Furthermore, joint custody means the child has an equal amount of time with both parents. If the court gives one parent sole custody, a visitation schedule will be given to the other parent to allow them time to see or visit the child. Overall, it's best for both parents to work together to do what's best for the child and their family. Now, what happens when parents don't agree on child custody? When parents can't agree on their child's custody, Iowa courts step in and make the decision for them. The evaluation of who will begin with both parents on equal ground. The court will determine a custody arrangement that will be in the child's best interest. A number of factors are considered in making this decision. It ranges from the location of the parents, whether each parent is suited to take care of the child. In other words, if you know one parent works late, would the other parent be best fit? Um, any history of abuse that the parents might have, uh, whether or not the child would be around anybody at risk, for example, somebody in the household who's a sex offender or, or who has a significant criminal history, and finally, the child's opinion. Uh, this decision also takes into account the child's age and ma uh, maturity in how they weigh the child's opinion. Judges have significant discretion when deciding the custody of a child. They will consider all of these factors above when making their decision. Now, how heavily will a court consider the preferences of the child directly? If a child is old enough and mature enough to have meaningful input, the court will consider their opinion heavily. There's no set age here. However, the judge will make a determination on a case-by-case -case basis. Generally speaking, if the child is in their teens or old enough to have an opinion on these matters, a judge will give it uh, significant weight. With younger children, the issue of parents influencing their children becomes an issue, making the child's opinion less relevant to this process. Coaching a child is highly advised against and will often lead to the child's opinion being not considered at all and the parent who did co uh, coach the child facing losing their child permanently. Now, do children have to testify in court? In Iowa, judges typically don't require children to testify about custodial preferences. Iowa courts believe that asking a child to testify about their preferences in front of their parents will lead to significant influence and likely testimony based on what the child believes the parents want to hear rather than their own preferences. This is often avoided. Instead, typically judges will interview uh, children in the court chambers to determine their preferences. 
Parents aren't allowed in the meetings, though the parent's attorneys sometimes attend. Finally, a judge could refuse to interview the child if they determine that the child's input simply isn't helpful. Another way the court can determine the child's preferences is by appointing an expert to meet and interview the child. In Iowa, judges can appoint a custody evaluator or a mental health professional to interview the child and the parents and then draft a report with recommendations for the court. Finally, I want to address modifying child custody orders in Iowa. As children grow up, their needs change. Parents can agree to change a custody or visitation order, and the courts will often approve it. If parents can't agree, the court will need to go through a similar process as what they initially did. A parent who wants to change a custody order will need to show that, since the last order, there has been a substantial change in circumstances. If the court agrees and believes that modification is in the best interests of the child, the court will evaluate using the same factors as the initial order. As always, if you have any additional questions, feel free to reach out to our firm. Thank you very much, and have a nice day. Hello again, this is Kevin O'Flaherty from O'Flaherty Law. I hope you enjoyed this video and podcast. If you did, we'd love it if you'd subscribe to our channel. If you need legal help in this or any other area of law, please do not hesitate to reach out and schedule a consultation. Most consultations are free and all can be conducted remotely if you'd like. Please email us, book online, or call us at 515-207-2006. We have many locations for your convenience. We serve all of Iowa. Thank you again for watching.